We don't always understand what other people are saying, but we pretend to because nobody wants to look clueless. Like at the mechanic. Yeah, you got a failed exhaust gasket right here in the manifold. Yep, that's what I thought too. Knew it was the gasket, doodad. Fancy restaurant. Oh, and tonight's special is the escargot cacave in Beaujolais Nouveau with a salad vert. Mm. Yum, that's my favorite. Even your teenager. Or the doctor's office when you talk about your blood sugar. It looks like your A1C is 10. Okay, is that good? But when it comes to your health, shouldn't you know basic details? Our four-part video series will help you learn the basics of your health numbers. Let's talk about blood sugar, or glucose. When you schedule your annual physical, and your doctor's office reminds you not to eat or drink anything but water for eight hours before the appointment, blame that on your blood sugar test. Your doctor needs results from when your body is fasting to get a more accurate picture of your blood sugar. Your fasting blood sugar number will fall into one of these three categories. Anything 100 or less is normal. 100 to 125 means you may be at risk for type 2 diabetes. 126 or higher means you have type 2 diabetes. Having high blood sugar can result in damage to your eyes, kidneys, nerves, and blood vessels. Knowing if you are at risk for or have diabetes is very important so that you can begin to prevent or control the condition. Once you know, you can improve your blood sugar level through diet, exercise, oral medicines, or insulin if necessary. The earlier you know about an unhealthy blood sugar level, the sooner you can begin to make lifestyle changes to improve your health. Mm -hmm. Thanks for learning about your health numbers. Check the description below for links to other videos in this series 